What is going on guys, this is RD and I'm just going to give you a quick little tutorial on how to create a 1.6.4 mod pack. Now this is kind of a cheap version, uh, so to say. If you want the original version from scratch, you could probably check out the description below. I'll have a link to uh, Buddy's Donkey Panics uh, tutorial that actually does it from scratch, but this is kind of like a cheap way to do it. Uh, the only thing you really need is a, uh, a Volts mod pack. And then you can download the donkey pack. Uh, I'll have a link for the donkey pack in the description down below. Uh, you can actually also play on it too. It actually has a lot of sweet mods on it. it has a, a metric shit ton of actually mods. Um, but anyway, you're going to need something like this. And you're going to need vaults downloaded. If you don't play vaults, uh, I would put it in vaults. I mean, if you don't play, just, you know, download something on the Technet launcher that you don't play. And it'll help you out a lot. So in this case vaults just go ahead and go here and just delete all this good stuff right here and it could be easy as this we're gonna go ahead and go back to the donkey pack gonna click that on make sure when you download in donkey pack you give a plus one so you support the actual uh, mod pack creator uh, since you're using his pack and go ahead and go down to vaults and all you gotta do is just paste it in there and another important thing to remember is uh, start your launcher in offline mode. So this could be either blocking it with your firewall for a short second and launching it and put it in offline mode. Or you can actually go to your internet. Uh, if it's like this, you can disconnect your internet from the uh, connection or you can unplug the ethernet cable. Either or and just launch it up in offline mode and then you can launch the internet back up. Uh, let's go ahead and go over here to uh, mods and we're just gonna go ahead and take all that stuff out so this is you know we're gonna make a custom mod pack type deal and you wanted to play on it with some of your mods like uh, Thumbcraft and things like that so in this case we're gonna select all this and if there's something you want to keep you can keep it but remember some mods rely on other mods to actually work so in this case we're gonna have to select chicken core and I want any eye to stay so let's go ahead and click any eye plugins any eye add-ons and I'm doing this by holding down control and clicking the items to deselect them so we're gonna do that and what we're gonna do we're gonna keep a mod let's go ahead and look for a mod we want to keep just for an example so iron chest we're gonna keep that all you gotta do is hit delete delete all that you should be left with this go back here you can go always go here if you want just go to the actual config file and deselect them all so you don't get uh, confused so let's go ahead and go through that and deselect the mods that we want to keep I think there's an iron chest one too yep so we got all that uh, let's see make sure there's chicken core and that should be it that's all the mods that we keep Go ahead and delete all those, and you should be fine. Now, when you want to in, uh, add a mod, all you would have to do is this. Go to the actual uh, mod creator website where you need to download it. Uh, actually, it actually says what you need in order for it to work. Like some mods need a special utility or a special mod to actually work. So in this case, we have to download this, which is the portal gun mod and this which is the iTunes utilities and all you would have to do after you downloaded those mods is drag and drop them in the mods folder and then all you would have to do now is just put that on hit play offline and it should launch up fine that should be pretty much see what happens should be any second there we go we got minecraft 1.6.4 load said before this is the actual cheap way i mean there's other ways to actually do it uh total you can but this is just an easier way to do it in my opinion when i found out i was i was making a, a small private uh, horror pack 
for in my series that's coming up. So uh, just go ahead and ignore that. That's from a save world from the donkey pack. And what you want to do is just create a new world and everything should be set up fine. Um, you shouldn't have any problems. If you do run into any problems, go ahead and let me know and I'll try my best to fix them or send you over to Donkey's channel and he sh should be able to help you out too. Let's go ahead and load this up and everything should be fine. Remember we wanted to keep uh, iron chests in any eye, so everything loaded up fine. Let's go ahead and look in our inventory. All right, we got any eye in our inventory, sweet. Let's go ahead and look for at mod dot portal gun. There we go, and we got all the portal gun junk. Sweet. There you go, and make sure it worked. Oh yeah. So let's go ahead and create a mode real. Go ahead. There we go. So all the portal gun works. Everything should work uh, just like it normally would. Go ahead and look for iron. Yep, we got the chests, so everything's set. That's all you need to do. Just drag and drop the mods inside the mod folder. If it does say something different to actually add the mods, um, you should have to do exactly what it says, basically. it's Everything warns you about what you're going to download. Some things might be uncompatible with other things. You might have ID conflicts. And in that case, just look at my other tutorial and you should be able to fix the ID conflicts. But in this case, iron chests. And we got all the iron chest stuff. Cool. A dirt chest 9000. I've not seen that yet. Go ahead and see what this does. Yeah. How do you use your dirt chest? Uh, hope you enjoy your many. <laughs> uh, this is awesome. Uh, but you can see everything's working fine, and if you have any problems, uh, just let me know. I'll try my best to fix them. But that's pretty much it for this video. Uh, if you enjoyed the video, please leave a like down below. Please comment down below what you're thinking. Don't forget to subscribe. It's free. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace.